Welcome back, back to the basement, the friendliest, friendliest place, place on YouTube. YouTube. Oh my goodness, we're in the Basement Craft server, and uh, we're going to have a real good time. Ted, are you excited? I'm so excited. I've been having a fun time playing with uh, other people besides Peter on here, and you can find Ooh. all of the uh, other Ooh. creators that are joining us for Basement Craft in the description. We encourage you to go give them a follow over on Twitch or on YouTube or both. And watch yes, their stuff. Depending you're gonna, on their you're gonna, flavor of choice, right? And seeing uh, just kind of how each individual individual person plays Minecraft in a different way. Um, it's been really fun watching Kyle Blaine bring his expertise, and uh, oh yes, Dad and Cat and JP bringing their um, lack of expertise. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and Peter and then bringing, us bringing like this our kind of chaotic style. Yeah, and our, of course. Our two different brands of uh, style too, as well. And, and, and Peter and into the mix. I, I think we got a gift. In uh, yes. someone left a little present for us, and I'm not talking about so, a pet leaving a present on the floor. <laughs> So this is pretty funny. I can't. I don't have control over this area of the map. <laughs> I don't have Ted Basement's permission to put that there. So I'm uh, gonna give you two blocks of dirt that maybe you could place there. I'm going to give you control. <laughs> there you go. I granted you permission. Oh, yay! Yay! <laughs> I can break that grass. So apparently okay, I so claimed a, this a... location. I don't remember doing that, but oh well. Um, a gift from Dad and Cat. <laughs> Ooh. Yes, we have a gift from Dad and Cat. Uh, should we take a look and see what's inside? I suppose we could both open it at yeah, the same time. Yeah, let's do it. We? Let's do it. Ooh, we got Ooh. a map. Ooh. Wow, a stack of ender pearls. That's pretty good. And some emeralds to get going. We got some rock hop. Oh, dude, a spyglass. Grab that. Oh, yeah. Well, dude. do you want it? No, no, no. You you take it. I You take it. You take okay. it. Okay. Once we have Optifine, there's no reason to have a spyglass, but still, it's cool. <laughs> it's a it cool thing. It is cool. It um, is cool. I've been enjoying it in, um, oh, look at that zoom action. I'm going to zoom in on Ted's ear. <laughs> Looking good, Ted. <laughs> hey, we're <Joe. laughs> Moving out of the way on you there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dad and Cat, thank you so much. This is generous. This is some really good stuff. I'm especially impressed with the stack of uh, ender pearls. Don't know how you came across that, uh, but there's no really super easy way to do that. So very impressive. Hey, but real quick, before we get into what we're going to be doing today, this week I got to hang out with somebody over near my base here on the Basement Craft server. Let's go take a look. All right, so near my base, I found uh, I found a cave here. Where does this cave go? Somebody clearly built this. This is not, this is not a naturally occurring cave. Torches and cobblestone. What will we find on the other end of this cave? I see a name tag. Who is this? Who Who is this? Oh, I hear voices. Hi. Do so confidently. Hello. Hi. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I was just having fun feigning ignorance about your existence near my base. <laughs> yes. Um, yes. My my little humble uh, <laughs> home away from home. Also, you have clearly. Oh no, you clearly haven't been here. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I definitely. So um, do so confidently, and I were uh, clearing out a cave down below here, and uh, she died and lost all of her good stuff, including an elytra. And I felt bad because it was sort of my fault, kind of. I was there. It was his idea. It was his idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my and uh, and so I went and I and busted a little bit and got her a new elytra. And it's cool because I got myself a backup elytra in the process. Which I'm so very very happy with. Um, yeah. but I'm I'm looking. Okay, you know what? I have an iron sword that is in the red. Here we go. <laughs> Perfect. That's that's uh. That's safe. That sounds good. What, start. <laughs> uh, show us your camp. This is kind of like sure. your little home away from home campsite here that you well, set up this nearby. Is more of my, this is more of my home that I'm never at campsite. <laughs> got it. Got it. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's just the, the bare basics for to survive, you know, bed, tent, shelter, food, fire, food. Um, but yeah, I kind of, I went when we went in busting, I was able to get some plants. So we got a little bit of variety here. And Ooh, chorus fruit. Nice. Yes. Ooh. And of course, gotta have my flowers. Of so, course, love nice. My flowers. But yeah, this is this is it. Um, as you saw, you go up to uh, to to get to get to your base and uh, go down to get to whatever mining operation is yet to be set up. That's cool. I want to I want to show everybody kind of like where you're set up oh, on sure. this cliff because it looks so cool. I'm gonna just fly out here and take a look. This big cliffside, and she set up this cool little campsite nearby. <laughs> yeah. I love it, right on the cliff. It's kind of one of those things it. where it's like, you're, 
you're 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 skirting with danger here a little bit. Like your campsite, yeah, you can easily fall loose. to your death. This is like one of those you things. Know, it's like she went camping and no one ever saw her again. <laughs> but you know, uh, nobody's getting the drop on me over here. That's true. The only thing that's getting the drop on is you on yourself. Oh no, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Which totally could yeah. happen. We all we all know that you have problems flying sometimes. Yes, yes. I'm really yeah. thankful for your help over here because um, on this base, kind of uh, my my own base, a little farther farther away from where Peter's is, you helped me build up this villager farm. Yes. Which has been yes. very helpful. And and over on uh, Twitch, a lot of the uh, people who watch on Twitch have seen some of this stuff because I've been streaming over there as well, kind of in between weekly episodes. Good. But we used that villager farm. We made an awesome iron farm that's just oh. producing tons of iron. Right. And uh, so this is what uh, this is what do so confidently made for us. Yes, I see you enclosed it. It looks good. Yeah, I'm starting to kind of decorate a little bit in here. And is, it, is it off right now? It is off. Now it's on. Now it's off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, this was, this was fun to make. I, uh, I've i only built one of these before. I built it on the Cup of Java server. And so, like, re doing this from memory was actually kind of fun to try and do. Yeah, it's kind of like a fun test of your redstone abilities and just like, understanding <laughs> how to move things around and manipulate the way villagers... Um, I, I wouldn't call it's it artificial pathfinding. intelligence. It's their pathfinding. It's, it's, yeah, it's, 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 it's <laughs> I would call it artificial stupid, but it, it still works. <laughs> Check this I out. Mean, do, I found out that I like do. barrels, and then you can use composters in there to give a little bit of a different... Uh, oh, yeah. As long as you don't put the composter on the top, it just kind of looks like a, another weird box. So. It does, like a crate. It looks like a crate. And you've... you've, you've ca cavified this as well. Yeah, lightly cavified. I mostly just covered it up. Um, but it needs to be decorated. This is pretty bad. <laughs> it looks <laughs> like I just put up a, a hill on top of another hill. <laughs> I can help you with that if you want. Yes. Oh, That's please, fun. please, please, please. <laughs> you were a little excited about that. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm just like, I, I know what my aesthetic is now. And it, it took me a while to figure out what it is. And I'm so excited to be a, a mining, yeah. a fat cat, uh, mining corporateer, um, and, uh, capitalist. Well, as a local uh, mercenary, you can be be sure to come by, drop me a note, say, hey, I need this decorated. <laughs> yes, or I need this person assassinated or whatever. That, that, that too. <laughs> that too. So far, the only culprit of that uh, endeavor has been me, so. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I'm excited. Kyle Blaine had a video where he is uh, starting to build some of this stuff out, and I just wanted to show Peter a little bit of this, too. This is the this area is the where teleport the spot, huh? Yeah, and this is where the uh, YouTube and Twitch creators that we're playing with are. We're all kind of building in this area together, which is gonna be fun. So, um, Peter, I'll, I'll show you how to warp utopian here in the future. Commune. Wow, <laughs> that's a uh, that's ambitious. <laughs> Basement craft creator utopian commune. Yes, <laughs> zooming in on it, looking real close <laughs> at it there. <laughs> But yeah, it's great. I mean, we've got, we've already got uh, some stuff. Oh, oh where'd our bells go? <gasps> they took the bells away. <laughs> yeah, maybe that was uh, Kyle. That might have been Kyle. Maybe he swiped him. <laughs> Dude, there's a great view of the river right here. Ooh, I'm coming. I'm coming. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see. I've heard some of his plans for like a dock and, uh, and he likes the ominous caves across the way. Whoops. Yeah, this river wasn't a river. He actually terraformed it. It was like two separate chunks of river, and he connected them together and made them look real. All right, if you look straight off that direction, there's like a little waterfall and a cave crevice. You can see the steps. It's like right to the left of the sun. And down, do you see this, the wooden steps in there? Uh, oh, yes, I see. I see so just So my now. secondary base is going to be in that mountain, and I've decided that in this season of cool. basement craft... I am a mining camp capitalist uh, pig, and that <laughs> I'm like I'm like the guy who's in like the kingpin of the mining camp, and so all of my Superb. builds are like mine mine based in the mountains. I enslave a lot of villagers to uh, to do <laughs> the mining. Yes, well that's helpful. And I mean, uh, I'm and useful. I'm supplying I'm already supplying at the shop. Um, I'm supplying iron blocks and gold blocks and uh, various uh, enchanting books. In fact, Peter, I gotta show you. So if you're facing the Basement Craft logo, 
Yes. You take a right. Which I am. Okay. And you jump down this waterfall without dying. Whee! I'm gonna, one of my projects is I'm gonna build a roller coaster that goes from spawn to the shop area for people who don't have Elytra yet. Sounds fantastic. Like me. But this is the shopping district. There are different shops Ooh. and stuff that have been built here already and are, are, are starting these, to be built. Are these pillars of smooth stone going to be, why is it saying I can't breathe? Cause you're underwater? I wasn't. Oh, that's a little like, different. Um, you can you can still kind of be underwater in Java, and it looks like you're not. Huh. Yeah. That's disturbing. So um, we've already got a couple shops set up here. I think this is I think this is Stevie Boy has an end shop selling some various things that you can find in the end, like end stone Ooh, and stuff. Nice. Um, up here, this is Welcome JP's to the end shop. Have a nice day. This is JP's store. He's selling food Ooh. and stuff, and he's got a little barbecue out here, so you can buy steak and put some steak on the barbie. Now open. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Watching you pull out that spyglass. Uh, Destroyer <laughs> hey, shop made a pumpkin too. shop. It's a cute Good. little pumpkin. You can buy pumpkins there. Oh, I love the acacia trap doors on there. Yeah, it's very, it's very clever. Pumpkin-y. Great Gaming Game has a store here selling um, gas tears and blaze rods. Wow, gas tears? Yeah, he's got a gas farm going. Dude, um, what on earth is going on with the pattern in this? Uh... I don't know. It seems a little random to me. It's not something I would choose, but it doesn't mean it's bad. It just uh... hey, if they got good stuff for sale in here, it doesn't bother me at I all. I think I think he has to be manning this shop in order for this one to work. Okay. But no, that's. <clears throat> I mean, I yep. wasn't interested in purchase anything today. I'm a looky loo. I'm so this is this is Dad and Cat. This is awesome. It's a Sphinx. Kawaii store. Oh, look at the face on the sign. Ooh. <laughs> 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 so Kawaii. But I told them that um because they're by a desert, I was like, dude, you guys should sell sand. Because even in like really big servers, sand is one of yeah. the highest commodities that people need and they don't want to go digging for it. They just yeah, I believe it because it's a little time sand. intensive, and then it's um, inventory intensive, right? And right. You lug so you need it back like and shulkers and, and all that stuff. Well, come over here. I got to show you my shop that I made. I don't know what you're looking at. Ooh, here. look! Oh, what I think this? we've got a problem. Is somebody making a I maze? Think we've got a Harold Brian problem. Uh oh! No, no, Hero Brian. He's not real. Not real. Well, two by two tunnels. <laughs> you know they stopped removing him in the patch notes. That's true. That's a concern. That is a concern. They used to remove him every patch, and now they've they've given up. All right, so uh, this is funny. In between the Sphinx shop and JP's shop is uh, there was a small area of unclaimed land in between, <laughs> and so Ashes <laughs> so there's claimed a safe this. Alley. <laughs> yeah, dude, how'd you get the sign purple? It's gorgeous. I think uh, Die did that. Oh, and that's a nice. Java thing. Come get some trinkets. So this safe. This, this is quite the little alley. <laughs> <laughs> there's blood on the ground. <laughs> Did you notice the little? <laughs> oh, it's not very safe. Wow, there's even soul sand. I think somebody died back here. <laughs> Do you know, like the brick in the um, granite? It's really nice. Yeah, it's and it like kind of gross, decrepit, but good you know? at the same time. Yeah, but there um there's a there's a shop. Ooh, sorry, Ashes. I accidentally knocked this sign out. <laughs> <laughs> from JP. Uh oh, do you know what it says? <laughs> um, but it, signs don't maintain their uh, right as entities. Right, right. So he didn't know what it said. He's got cardboard boxes back in this alleyway, but um, he sells things out of his dumpster. So he's got random <laughs> stuff, and there's a little book, and uh, he sells basically like not great items. Sometimes there's really good items in there. Sometimes there's just garbage in there. Faded papers, clocks. <laughs> Plastic Easter egg. <laughs> Questionable drink. <laughs> there was a quote unquote medicine at one point. Nice. <laughs> Dude, this is fantastic. I like it back here. Yeah, the alley's pretty cool. Alright, now you gotta see my shop. I'm really proud of my shop. Alright. Because I'm the I'm the I'm the mining kingpin gangster, okay? <laughs> Way to run into the fire. <laughs> hey. 
That's how I do, okay? <laughs> this is the, this is my store. It's called Check out the sign. Rock bottom minery and supply shop. Our prices are rock bottom. <laughs> Our prices are so low, you'll think we went crazy. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> but check this out. Hey. We got multiple levels. I don't have Ted Basement's permission to press this button. Okay, fine. I'll give you container trust. What's going to happen? Oh, that might be a bad idea. Well, you just got to be follow the honor system and I'll give you container trust so you can you can access switches and containers here. This is how most people will be able to access the shop, but you can't build in this uh, claimed area. So you can OK, it's okay. basically like your adventure adventure mode in this claimed space. Eight gold blocks for one diamond. Mending book. For two diamond, oh, I would buy those. I know. I was like, that's what Peter would buy for sure. Four iron block for one diamond. Ooh, that's not a bad idea either because I'd rather get diamonds than iron at a certain point in the game. Well, but and especially if you start running a shop, a right? You start running a shop, yeah. people will give you diamonds for your stuff. So the economy side of this is going to be really interesting to see how that evolves. But look at this. This is a right, big mining sure. crane. You can drop that. I mean, it doesn't actually drop down. But uh, go ahead and take the uh, take the roller coaster Ooh, down like to the, the second level. Let's still get it hop in here. Yep, and hit the button. T Did you not actually get in the cart? You just stood I on it. I failed to get in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come around. Come around up here. So this is the uh, this is the second level of my shop. I'm gonna have other stuff nice. for sale down in here, but ooh, I like your stalactites. Yeah, I'm adding some dripstone down in here. Got lots of lanterns and barrels. I like getting the stuff for myself, but at the same time, I like the economy side. Like if I can just gain economic power. Right. Well, that's true. You can get good at um, gaining certain things that are hard to like build up to being good at getting. Yeah. And then instead of having to build up to everything else, other people can get good at that stuff, and then you guys can trade. Like that just makes sense. It's the way. It's the way the world know, works. economies work. Is uh, you know, you I bring something of value to people you. in a good way. Everyone who you know, if you're good at something. Let other people who are good at other things reward you for being good at what you're good at with their stuff. Right. It's mutual exploitation. If you want to TP to me, Matt, back at our our base. Uh, Peter, show me a little bit so of what you've been doing here. Give me a little update. Uh, yeah. Well, there's there's not too much, but uh, I recorded a few episodes for a different platform, and uh, I just went ahead and uh, leveled this a little bit and slapped uh, some wheat in it. Love and it. And then... Uh, did the absolute bare minimum to make it make sense as far as like um, like the cobblestone goes all the way down. Okay, I'm gonna get that cow and maybe you can grab some materials or something if because we had ideas about that tower, right? Yeah, absolutely. So I'm gonna go grab Getting some of the materials. Going we're gonna bit. get that tower built. Um, so that's what we said we were gonna do in this episode, but we ended up actually <laughs> kind of like going around and getting caught up and taking a little bit of a tour, which I think was a good use that of time to see what everybody's been up to. Yeah, it will definitely be tower power time though in uh, in the next episode because we here's where we're at. It's gonna be great. Uh, ooh, do I have to get good at MLG water? No, I I dumped the water down in the middle of the tower so we can just kind of like build up and then drop down and then build up and then drop down. Brilliant! Oh, yeah. the view up here, it's fantastic. I'm a All right, so uh, that's going to do it for this time in the basement. Uh, click on things. We have a series of this. Yes. Um, so, you know, you can click on the playlist. It's on the screen right now. Or unless we're... Are we doing the patron end screen on these? Uh, yeah. If uh, if you would like to play with us on the Basement Craft server, you can become a $5 patron or more, and we will give you access to come and play with us and the other creators that are hanging out with us here. Uh, feel free to do that. No pressure. But uh, I know some people right have on. expressed an interest in that. Um, and then yeah, watching uh, is free. Yes, Playing watching is a very good deal. And commenting is, oh. is free and liking the video is free and all that <laughs> stuff. So check out the rest <laughs> of the series uh, and we will see you guys next time in the basement. In the basement. <laughs> <laughs>